The very first hill on the Drakenfire roller coaster sends your stomach toward your throat, then right back down again on the curves. The forces of physics are at work here, forces that are being measured and recorded by these kids. Point B is the lowest point here, right over the water. High school students from as far away as China, Vietnam, and Kuwait are competing here, working their way through dozens of problems. Some watch from below, matching actual speeds against theory to measure friction. Others climb right on board with calibrated tubes, checking the gravitational force on the turns. Um, OK, this, I believe, is the vertical accelerometer. Each line on this is one G-force, so if we're hitting the four G-force thing, I don't want to be the poor schmuck holding this. The point of this Olympiad is simple. Physics is more than just an exercise for the classroom. It's a real-world investigation into just how things work. And it also can be fun. Are you having fun? That's right, yeah. Haven't been on this thing yet. That's one evil-looking machine, though. That's all I can say. Come on, now! Oh, hold on! It's just like studying! It is fun, but it's also important. Just ask former Nobel Prize winner, Dr. Leon Lederman. Someday, in this global world we're heading for, these kids are going to meet as scientists and work together and understand each other, and this is a part of that. You gotta like America, don't you? Yeah, America's great. Of course, physics is great, too. With its international principles, it knows no cultural boundaries. And better still, it keeps these cars on the track. In Williamsburg, Bob Woodruff, WTVR. News Channel 6.